So, everybody of us here from Armenia in Oslo, first of all, you just come off stage from your first rehearsal. How was it for you? It was wonderful. I'm impressed, very impressed, uh, because this is the work of real professionals. You know, I took part in many uh, concerts in general, in big concerts, but I never saw such a good uh, work, such a good job of uh, people. Everything is very, very uh, good. Yeah. <laughs> and um, you've just been to the press conference and seen all the media attention. Have you ever experienced this kind of crazy atmosphere before? Well, uh, yes, but not uh, so many people. <laughs> but you know, if you like what you do, then it's not a problem. I didn't uh, feel uh, bad, something, nothing was wrong. Well, it was just positive and uh, ener my energy was positive and I uh, felt that uh, the energy of uh, the people was uh, the same mm -hmm. and it helped me, it really helped me. And Armenia has this amazing record in Eurovision, it's never finished outside the top ten. Now, yes. You're singing a very patriotic song yes. with a very famous Serious. player. Yes. Do you feel pressured? I'm sorry? Do you feel pressured? Pressured? Do you feel under pressure? Under pressure? No, no. Mm, I will repeat that uh, if you like what mm -hmm. you do, uh, then everything will be okay. It's not my job, no. It's the way of my life, really. I cannot live without sinning. Uh, and if, uh, if a sinner uh, is sure of himself, I, I, I don't know if I'm uh, speaking correctly, but if uh, a sinner is sure of himself, then uh, Eurovision or the concert uh, in his kitchen, I'm sorry, uh, it's the same. Yeah. It's made by love, mm -hmm. only with love. Uh, that's why I'm happy that I have a chance to represent my native country and I don't feel uh, like they made me to do that mm -hmm. or... Uh, and I know that if I will take the 20th place, they will love me mm -hmm. and they will meet me with love. And um, have you seen Eurovision before? Of course. Favorite course. songs? Every year. Your favorite songs from the past? Uh, favorite songs. Uh, Helena Paparizu. Uh -huh. uh, I don't remember all the songs, but I remember the songs of Saikis Ruvas and uh, the Ukraine last year. Mm -hmm. I liked it. It was so energetic song. Mm, and. Uh, some, well, it's hard now to remember them, but I know all the songs. And where were you when you found out that you were going to be in the Armenian selection? Where? Where were you? What were you doing when that phone call came? Uh, I was at home, and my producer called me and asked me a question. Yeah, Eva, what will you tell me? What will you answer if I will say that you will take part in the national selection of Armenia? I said, of course I will be happy, I will do it with pleasure. I even didn't think maybe yes or maybe not, no. I said yes and I said I can win. And then he told you? What? And then he told you for real? Yes, yes, of course. Course. And uh, finally, is there anything you want to say to anyone watching on the internet, on YouTube, to ESC Daily viewers? Uh, this is for... ESCDaily.com It doesn't say on there, but... <laughs> okay. mm, I just want to say that uh, I'm very happy that I have a chance to talk to you and to say to you what I feel. Uh, I hope that you will like my show and you will like my song because uh, I swear I do that for the people, not for me. Uh, I'm interested in that just because uh, this is the way of my speaking, the song. And the main thing for me is the people, you, to understand 
uh, and to sing with me. If you will sing with me, I will be happy. It's, uh, it will be my victory. Thank you. Thank you very much and good luck. Thank you.